Hello, princesses. It's me, Spongy Daddy sixty four, Agent Zetsenica. Welcome to the start of my new series. Well, new if you're watching it now. If you're watching it in the future, it's probably not going to be new, but you know what I mean. So yeah, we're going to be playing Okame. Okami. See so, yeah. here. And I haven't played this game before. I've only really read the manual and stuff. It's not really. See so, yeah. I mean, I know the story, at least, but I'm not going to give anything away, because... <laughs> just, just, you know, I want... I just like to be weird, like that. This isn't like Metroid's upper end, where I kind of played the game for. Saving in progress. Do not touch the power or reset the game. Once upon a time, in a faraway land, there was a tiny village by the name of Karmi. Legends tell of a horrible beast that threatens the residents, which looks like dragons, it seems. It, all, it also tells a wolf that risks all, all of it to protect it. Controlling the very fabric of existence, the, the wolf stood up against the beast many times its size and banished it the darkness. This interesting wolf is an act unheard in an era of tranquility. The villagers' heart swelled with respect and appreciation of this wolf, I think. Everywhere this wolf walks, it's just flowers. Wow. I like the art style. It's like drawn. Did I make this game? <laughs> oh, Kami! So yeah, first, that's before we begin the game, I'm just going to do the options and video output, I'm going to make the sound a bit less, and we'll, put, we'll do standard TV because we don't have a special television, we just have a standard one. At least I think this is standard anyway, I can't, I can't confirm that my television is standard. Ogami! Ogami! I think that's how you pronounce it, but whatever. Okami. I'm not sure if, what that means. I assume it means God, though. Story. Hidden. Kamari. Long, long ago, a tiny helmet, helmet even, <laughs> known as Connector communications with the Wii Remote have been interrupted apparently. Oh, yeah, I forgot. Oh, yeah, let me change the batteries. Hold on. Hold on. <laughs> My battery is uh, dead apparently. Yeah. Okay. Known as Common, laid near a grove of pride and beautiful cherry blossoms, each and every tree around the uh, Whiteberg was honoured as a good. However, the villagers was not right its dark secrets. So this is where I guess these dragons came in. I mean that's what they look like. <laughs> now it's a hydra. <laughs> to the, this to separate a part of the Orca, a fearsome quick caved dwelling beast, a young maiden was offered as a sacrifice at the annual festival. With a body like a mountain and eight heads and necks and eight heads mouth on, mouth on necks at the size of tree trunks, its blood red eyes along 
were said to cause anybody who gazed into them, no one dares to disobey the horrifying beast I'm trying to pay attention, but my brother just like comes in. You're not helping to us then, we're only five minutes in, are they? When the nights of sacrifice drew near, a mysterious white wolf appeared outside the village. This wolf, its coat as brilliant as snow, was dubbed Sh Shine Annual. The wolves kept a watchful eye on the, anybody who ventured outside the village and made it a habit of prowling through the streets at night. People assumed the wolf to be a Farmal of Orca, that makes no s I don't know what that means, but whatever. I like the music. <laughs> One villager took it upon himself to face the fearsome Shinya. The warrior Naga attempted many times to challenge the wolf, but his attempts were prized away by Shinya's swift movements. So the best warrior couldn't even hurt him or her. Before long, the night, the night of the an, a, 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 a ancestral festival had arrived. A white plummeted arrow hit, headed the coming sacrifice. Pushing the sky as the arrow struck it, turns it into the home of Nyama, the village's most beautiful maiden. Nyaga had seen love for... Damn it, we Moke. <laughs> we Moke, you screwed me over. Had secret love for Nyama, who emerged, who was enraged by his side, determined to put an end to what Orca wanted to support. Nyaga traveled to the beast's cave in the place of his in place of his beloved. That was just me checking, checking the batteries. The moon came, the place as dark as evil itself, served as Oka's home. As Nagai stood, raging for the entrance, the beast appeared, eyes growing crimson, crimson even upon a freshening neck. Oka had stood, tall but towards him, anxious. Another sacrifice. Nagai leapt up, leapt with incredible clear, swinging his blade viciously on, on, on his slice. Eyes welling into the deep, into the moonless night. But only, but only his hide was like steel, the blade was left, left nearly a scratch. So you just keep slashing, I don't know. Do what Link would do. <laughs> At long last, Nero's and Angie swim from the Crimson Beach, dropped to his knees, fatigued and gasping for a breath. He, he knew he was staring death in the face. It was that then that the wolf appeared as if it would protect Nero and it stood in its ground before Oka. In the darkness of the cave, this wolf coat shone brilliantly. As so, it was shining out the wolf that the world outside the village brings itself fierce and claws. Shining leapt with claws over and over and rid, reared its terrifying heads, raining its fangs for battle. The two beasts struggled wildly, thrashing in the darkness. <laughs> Sounds a bit wrong, but whatever. <laughs> yeah, I'm not gonna make stupid people Mystery and terrifying. And terrifying. The, the, the separate continued. Shenra summoned gusts of devilish, of divine winds and encounter opposes his flames. As Ozen closed in on the and sharp and claws the last time. The John Dunning to trees suddenly sprouted forth and shielding the wolf. 
Sonia is full grass and green the other hand. However, Tokar and protected by a mysterious power, was not easy to be beaten. Sonia had been covered in gaze. Masters and Co. died crimson, stood exhausted before the mighty Opa. At least I'm I hope I'm pronouncing it right, I can't just... No. I don't know what this game is truly about because I haven't looked anything up about it. I can't even saw a chance to strike. Alright, what would be the final blow? But Sharon refused to give in. With its last ounce of strength, the mighty wolf gazed to heaven and I used the mighty howl. Suddenly the black clouds of the overhead disappeared. The light from for example, they had off Ning Gai Saw as a beacon of hope. It's just like 10 hours long, like, it's like 9 minutes long. Okay, we're going to get a rock and stuff, this is going to be here while. Guided by Tiny Saw, Nergo, who has taken Shara in the shadow, stood proudly to face his uh, adversary, which it sounds awesome. <laughs> Challenged his strength, so he scrubbed into battle's arms. He leapt ferociously towards Oka and his sword pointed high. The golden sword danced in his hand like a puppet on a string. One by one, Oka's fearsome heads separated from their owner. It looks like the heads actually have different hats, it seems. Or something. Ozone bodies collapsed. Uh, in a lake of its own blood. In that instant, the entrance of played the village as was lifted as the battle was decided. The sun shone once again in the sky. Some risen had scrambled to Odin's, succumbed to Odin's poison and struggled to breathe. Now Gan scooped the beast into his arms and returned to Kamar. This is very long. How long have I been reading for? It seems like forever. Wow, okay. When they reached the village, Kama was no longer moving. The villager, Elder, gently stroked the wolf's head. In response, Harrison led out a hoarse and pitiful bark. Wow. It closed its eyes and drifted off as into a slumber. Plot twist, he died. <laughs> He said last restored to Kamara village in the honor of Chandra and here wrote exactly. Oh, he did die. <laughs> okay, um, the villagers in those in a shine and placed a statue of the wolf within it. Oh, oh did he die? I'm gonna say he did. Now, now it's sort of inscripted Tamaka and placed it inside the moon cave. The villagers all look forward to a long age of endless peace. However, this is not the end of the story! There is more to this tale than the most people know! 100 years have passed since Nagara and Shaka are heroic exploits. It had been so quickly that nobody in the village even knew it took notice, 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 notice. Not the graphical stars. Yep. It's just a legendary sword. Is this Tiger the sword that banished the dreaded Okana? I mean, Oka. Dot dot dot. No, it couldn't be. Is he trying to lift it up? It's just a legend, nothing but a fairy tale. Oh, are you welfare? He's like welfare from draw to life. Oh no, what did he do? Oh, he who seeks power, he will, he who has broken my bones. Seek the words I wish darkness untold to the world. Oh crap, I said it. <laughs> oh, that throw upon me and unleash my power.
gun. Oh, there it is. It's like, oh! <laughs> I was just pretending. And this game knows me. I made it. I, I knew I made this game. Just kidding. Man, this is very long. It's like Twilight Princess all over again. It's just like too much cinematics. A horrible t train is suddenly swept across, the o swept over the land. And however, there was one village that seemed to escape the ter terrible curse. A tiny settlement of Kama village enjoyed the protection of a scale tree. It is here that the real story begins. Couple up. Wood spirit, Shinka. How terrible! This is just like the Emperor's prophecy of doom. It is a terrible to bring about such calamity. We must act quickly. There is no time to lose. My power has dimmed over the years. I am spent protecting this area. I don't have much time left in these world in this world even. I must say, now is your time. We have never needed your power more. Shine your divine light upon this broken and haunted world. Let your heavenly rays become our hope and you guide us all. Like Wolf Link all over again. Okami Astia Amastra. Ah, such divine, such divine white light, such beauty and glade. The only one escape of such a wondrous retinue is none other than our mother and the origin of all that is Amastra. How to find to see that the saviors who brought the you know, brave sacrifice sailed away the evil demon so many years ago has not been roasted one bit. Seeing you emerge after so many years has spent me into bright happiness to my heart. Gaze above you and take in the horizon of the sky. Since your untimely departure from this bit, our mist, the world has scrambled to, to devilish and precious beasts. We have reigns of grandness in the territory. Country of Nipia Dipon. But never has these circumstances has the circumstances been worse than they are at this very moment. Please use your powers to banish the darkness and punish those who have do us some harm. Mm -hmm. Give us your huh? What is this? Has something stolen your way into my robe? Ho ho ho, Merry Christmas, she's become Santa Claus. Oh ha ha ha. Ah, ha, ha, ha. Phew, what's on earth? What is it? You again? Ow 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 ow, are you nuts? Boy, for a little thing, you sure are making a big fun. I was just trying to make the conversation a bit more interactive, that's all. Weren't you nipping in my clothing? 
clothes again, Rug. Bug, I tell you, a thousand, I told you a thousand times not to call me that. I'm a, a wandering artist. The name's Inja. I'll show you how good I am with, when, and it will, i show you how great I am. It will be worth, when, it won't be a long time before you're bound but towards my great brush. I like it. Well, what do you think? You think you're doing the real thing, huh? Yeah, it's good. I'll say for you, Fireball, you look kind of down in the dumps. Actually, you look kind of familiar. I've got it. You just look like that statue of Sangha. Wow, what do you think you're trying to do? Are you crazy? A handsome guy like me should never be covered in wool slobber. You regret messing with the great insane. Don't make me use my prize sword, don't make us against you. What is that? Oh, that's that growling sound. And what's it? Why is it so dark anyway? Oh, great god, Amasar. I use all the power I have to protect commerce and village. The village lives on, on the spirit's light. In grace to my fruit, cut it free and the village will be reborn. I trust in you. I know that you will lead us won't let you will lead us down the right path. Only you, your awesome power can restore the life life to this world. The trees resume to normal, huh? That's something girl, sure. Said some weird stuff. The village spirits are being kept inside the fruits. That's the fruit. The girl said uh, if you cut it down, the village will be restored. But it's awfully high up there, so you don't use some kind of special power. There's no way you're going to reach it. The darkness is really getting to me. A lot can happen when you're taking a nap. So now I can walk around, yay! Yay, we can finally play! Oh, only 22 minutes in! Where are we? It's gotten awfully quiet all of a sudden. I don't remember any place like this in the village. Well, we better keep our eyes peeled. You can use the control pad to look around. The two button changes your point of view. Boy, you really look so helpless. Are you sure you're gonna be okay? So let's try this. So the cam oh god the camera's in bird. <laughs> no. Oh whatever, I'll get used to it. Okay, so two changes your perspective and hold your two seems to put you in first person. Where the camera isn't inverted, which is weird, okay. A seems to be jump, B does nothing, Z makes you bark, C makes me dig, it seems. Wee menu makes the Wii menu come up, which is really a lot, which is how you... And one's use the map, interesting. What's this? Hold on, this is an organ, an organ mirror. They say your reflection appears on its surface. Your memories will be stored in the memory for all eternity. Well, to put it shortly, you can save your progress here. Thanks. I might have to use it actually because I'm getting <laughs> quite a bit in. This has been a very long episode. And let me give you a little advice. You should save a number of files. That's why you can always go back if you get stuck or something. Okay. I'm gonna do that anyway because I'm recording. Gotta be fair, especially when you're still learning the ropes. Okay. So we're gonna save here and we'll come back next time.
So thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys next time. What, what, what's going on? Oh, nothing. I thought, I thought something was happening, like a cut screen. Never mind. So thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys next time.